How did it work? Where did you come to after your procedure, and somebody had to break the news to you that you you your knee was hurt more, or you you knew that going into your procedure, Vaughn? No, so um, you know, Dr. Cooper, um, I had a lot of respect for Dr. Cooper. He did, um, you know, he did some of the colleagues, some of my colleagues around the league, and you know, I've paid attention to their progress and their recovery, and they did great. And um, you know, Nate Nate Breska here at the Buffalo Bills. Um, we were all in Dallas, and we we're having a meeting. And the MRI said that you know my ACL was intact and everything was good. Um, but when you test, when he tests, when Dr. Cooper tested my knee, you know he felt um, that it might be compromised. So he he uh, we went in there to just do a scope, and you know um, it, to still give me a shot to be able to play this season. Mm-hmm. And um, you know he told me like when I go in there and I do this scope, I'm gonna look at the ACL and I'm gonna test it out. And if it is not, uh, if it's compromised, then I feel like the best thing for you to do is just go ahead and and get this uh, you know fixed right now. And if you, as you can imagine, there is there is no place in the calendar for you know seven to nine weeks you know recovery. Right. There's just no place in the football calendar. It's not a good time to do that. But you know he said that you know. If it, if it was compromised, we'd do it right now. So I'm going. To, I'm getting. They're prepping my legs, and you know they're shaving it up. And he marks the right one. Said I'm gonna scope this one, and you know if it's if I go in there and if it's compromised, then we do the whole surgery. So I knew like going into it that it was a possibility. I didn't think that mm. you know it would happen because I still wanted to play, but I trust Dr. Cooper and went in there. I woke up and. You know, I'm all loopy, and he told me that he went ahead and did it, and you know, I, I was, uh, I knew that that was the best thing to do because wow. I really trust Dr. Cooper and his work. How did I mean when you come to and you're no longer loopy? I mean, that had to be a blow for you, man. That had to be significant for you. No, man. Man, you know, I'm, I'm all about not like not blinking. Um, right. I'm all about just, I, I'm not dwelling on on anything. I'm just, I'm, I'm continually uh, moving. I'm I'm a big mindset guy, and I'm not I'm not going to be down. Of course, you know I want to be out there with my teammates. Of course, you know playing football on Sunday, second a quarterback. That's what I do best. That's what I do more than anything else in the world. But at the same time, I'd rather focus on the road to get back there, and not me not actually being there. All right, Von Miller. Um, so I, I guess just an open-ended question: You're not done, right? You're going to keep playing football. You're going to rehab. You're going to get back out there, right? Man, Rich, I got a six-year deal, and, okay. and right when I signed this, you know, my my mindset was to play all six years. So, you know, that's another that's another thing that really just you know keeps you know me, you know, in a great place mentally is knowing that you know I'm gonna be able to come back and have multiple shots at this thing. So, um, no, I'm 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 not done. My son is only one. I need I need to play at least you know four or five years for him to re- remember what I'm doing. Fantastic! Catch the Rich Eisen show every single day on the Roku channel, twelve to three Eastern, for free. 